Hi guys, this is Chris, and today I'm gonna help you guys to understand the isolated margin and how to use it. Okay, let's get to this. Well, the uh, the first part is the uh, the definition of isolated margin and cross margin. Okay, today we're gonna focus on like, isolated margin. The definition of the isolated margin is that under the isolated margin mode, there is a fixed value of the position margin. And it starts with the initial margin, which can be changed by adjusting the leverage, risk limit, and withdrawal margin. When the margin balance is lower than the maintaining margin, a forced liquidation will be triggered. This is very important. At this point, the position margin, only the position margin, can be the largest loss for the user, while the, uh, the cross margin is on the contrary. If you're gonna open a position in cross margin mode, okay, and you f you, you made a forced liquidation, it means you will lose all your balance in your futures account. Okay, this is our futures uh, trading chart. All right, you guys can click over here at the uh, left upper corner right here, and you can change the uh, the margin mode and. Uh, the leverage all right for example we choose isolated margin and we use five times leverage confirm let's see isolated margin and five times leverage all right let's get to this we enhance the page uh for example we met this situation and for the daily trader okay uh, for the daily trader and you must you must pay attention to this for example we uh we met this uh situation right now you guys can check the uh the the trading volume was not bad right and they had a very good bullish candlestick right here and right now it is uh, a bullish trend for this period right for this period and uh, how would you do for example if you want to trade you think oh it keeps going up right it, it keeps going up and you would think oh what if it, what if it will keep going up like this right and uh, how will how will how will place an order from here you're gonna place a short order or a long order okay how do you think about this all right so when you met such situation and uh, you're not 100 percent sure it's going up or going down we could use the isolated margin all right for example at the beginning, we have uh, mentioned the uh, the definition. The most important of the definition is that if you open a position, okay, only the uh, the position margin will be forced liquidation, and you only lost this position. For example, you have a hundred bucks, and uh, you use five bucks as a, a, a position margin, right? And if this this order this position uh, was forced liquidate, you're gonna have let's say 95 bucks left only five bucks you, you you lose right you only will lose five hundred five bucks and that's it and we met this situation now we're in a bearish market and you you find this a uh, bullish trend how will you see okay and no matter you're gonna open long or open short we use isolated margin let's just have a little try right you just try it for example we 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 assume it's gonna going up right and we use let's say five percent of your uh balance right and uh, if you're wrong if you're wrong you're gonna just lost five percent of, of of your whole margin right and that's it you won't be influenced right you can still keep trading but if you're gonna use uh the the, the cross margin mode right and you're gonna lose all your all your margin all your position all, all your all your balance if you made a forced uh forced liquidation right and this is the uh, the first uh, scenario you're gonna met right this kind of scenario is like that uh for example like elon musk make a post uh tweet something that about the coins bitcoin things and the bitcoin price will will going up will go up or go down in a very short time and you don't want to lose this opportunity you want to place an order, but you don't. Nobody want nobody want to lose out their 
margin, right? You can use the isolate margin to open a small position over here. If, if you're gonna, if you're right, you're gonna make some profit and it's not so bad. It's better than loss, right? And if you lost it, it's just, you know, just 5% or 10% of your margin and it still won't be a very big problem or trouble for you, right? Just a small part of your margin. And when you meet to something that you are not 100% sure and you could use isolated margin with a small fund to test it to have a try and especially for some rookies you know new futures traders who are not very familiar with the market and you could have a try with some small fund some small position like isolated margin right and especially for the daily trader right if you are a daily trader I would suggest you to use isolated margin all the time it will protect your assets and in the uh in a in, in a bigger s scale and we could call it the uh, the risk management right and let's check out the uh, the second uh scenario all right for example uh if we have we uh, found something that is uncertain for example over here and we could get a screenshot over here all right uh, we could check out this period. See, all the, uh, the, actually we could check this period. And, uh, in this period we could, we could notice that the, uh, that the market is, uh, going down, up, down, up, down, up, and the down, up, down, up, up to here, and down, and up, right? Things like that it's, it's in a correction, right? And you're not sure it's gonna go up or go down, okay? But this is in a very high uh, place, right? It's, the price is kind of high for the moment, and uh, the buy power is kind of tired, or they lose their power, and they have tried let's say one, two, three, four. It has tried four times, right? And we find that they all failed to break this point, right? They can't break this point and they just keep failing, right? And we could say, oh, the buy power has lost its strength and we think it probably gonna go in down, right? But you're not 100% sure, okay? For example, you're not a day trader, you're a long-term trader. And uh, if you're not 100% sure, you could place an order here and use isolated margin isolated margin guys as a test still as a test right like the uh, the first one you just have a try over here with small font and if you're right you could add more font over here or over here and it's keep going down you're gonna gain profit right but if you're wrong it it goes up just use some small font with isolated margin and if you lose this small font it's no big deal right and that's it uh, this is how to use the uh, isolate margin when you met such scenarios. If you guys have any problems about this uh, isolated margin mode or cross margin mode, you can leave a comment or drop your questions below in the comment section. All right. I'll pick three best questions to give 10 bucks each and you can have a try of our futures trading. Uh, that's it. Bye.